Hey hockey player, in this video I want to run you through an advanced hockey conditioning workout taken right from phase 5 of the 2019 off-season domination system. This is an advanced workout that the athletes of HockeyTraining.com have progressively worked up to, meaning it's something that you would do a little bit later on in the off-season, before camps, before the season, and once you've already had some good training under your belt. Let's get into it. To kick this workout off, we're just going to start with some low effort runs. I just want you to get loose. I just want you to get warmed up. You see Kevin shaking out his arms a bit here, shaking out his legs a bit here, only moving at 50 to 60% speed. I want you to perform anywhere from two to five of these runs at a distance of anywhere from 20 to 40 yards. You know the drill here. Just get loosened up and ready to rock. Now that the warm up's done, we're gonna start our first exercise. We're gonna bring up the intensity with the horizontal crossover step into sprint. With this exercise, you wanna place your body laterally, perform two exaggerated crossover steps, and then explode laterally off that foot into a forward 25 yard sprint. We're gonna repeat this for eight total rounds with 45 seconds in between. But what's most important to understand is you keep that foot nice and lateral for the explosion. Notice how Kevin's chest, hips, and toes are all facing laterally before he explodes into a forward sprint. Don't turn too early. We're trying to work on that lateral power and lateral conditioning here that you need to skate faster on the ice. The next exercise is everybody's favorite. We're gonna do some suicide runs. How this one works is you're gonna sprint five yards and back, 10 yards and back, and then 15 yards and back all sprinting as fast as possible. What's really important to point out here is how Kevin's total body is passing the cones before he turns around. Make sure both feet and your body are passing the cone before you turn around because you want to get the full yardage done in this suicide run to target the energy system that we're after here in this hockey specific conditioning workout. Repeat this four times with 45 seconds rest in between each run. To finish this workout off, we're gonna be supersetting planking with your left foot in the air and then going right into planking with your right foot in the air. The plank all by itself is already an excellent exercise for injury prevention and also to help keep you strong on the puck out in the ice, but as you begin to master the plank and as the plank gets easier over time, one ways in which you can progress this exercise and make it more difficult to create a greater training stimulus on your body is you remove one of your points of ground contact. So here we remove one leg, 30 seconds, and then hold the other leg up in the air, keep that up for 30 seconds, at the end, you've done a 60 second plank, but you've removed stabilization standpoints to make it a more difficult exercise and therefore make it a better exercise for your hockey performance. The reason why this workout is so effective at improving your hockey conditioning is twofold. Number one, it's specific to the energy system needs that you're going to use out in the ice. And number two, it incorporates both forward and lateral progressions that incorporate all the coordination and muscle sequences that you use while you're skating. The energy system component is incredibly important because conditioning is not an umbrella statement. What a marathon runner does for conditioning is different than what a power lifter does for conditioning is different than what a hockey player does for conditioning. The word conditioned means nothing without context. You have to match it up with the energy system demand that you're using out in the ice so that you can improve where it counts during game time. Thanks for watching our hockey conditioning workout. If you liked that video, smash the thumbs up button and subscribe to the hockey training channel. And if you want more information on the complete off season domination hockey training system, click on the link in the description. And for your free relentless conditioning package to give you a gas tank that lasts all three periods, click on the link in the comment section below and let's go.